I'm not happy when I look at the number of murders and deaths we've had in the city. I'm not happy when I see people who are not housed in tents. They're living in tents on streets and they're not getting the services they need. I'm not happy when I see the fentanyl issues that are killing communities, literally. Impassioned answers to questions following a news conference at Rainier Playfield, called by Mayor Bruce Harrell to unveil a $115 million a year budget for Seattle parks. Everything from climate change to meeting the needs of a BIPOC community. That budget includes nearly 600,000 to winterize, reopen and maintain all public restrooms. 3.6 million to add 26 park rangers. Currently, there are two. 2.4 million to expand community center hours and 600,000 to clean up graffiti and vandalism. He voiced concerns about encampments he says impacted 100 parks in 2021. He says they now affect a few dozen. That if a person has nowhere to sleep, you can't put a person in jail because that's their only means. But you could put reasonable restrictions in the parks to make sure you don't have syringes in the parks. Currently, the city helps fund a new regional homelessness authority. The mayor says he plans to continue putting money toward it, but will demand accountability. He also confirmed he plans to ask a federal judge to release Seattle police from the consent decree process while continuing reforms. So Seattle, stop playing small ball. Let's play big ball. Let's, a, let's attack racism. Let's attack police reform. Let's revitalize our, our downtown. That's, that's big ball. In Seattle, Erica Zucco, King 5 News.